Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of 1 vs. 1 Ranked Duel. Baron and mainly Barakasura are, are through, which is going to be annoying. We're going to be taking a look at the new Let's go, Let's Scotty get skin. Um, so we're up against Barakasura, which is going to be annoying. But I'd much rather play against Barakasura than a Pele, 100%. The Rainbow 9. Damn. So yeah, we're gonna take a look at this new skin. This is not an Odyssey skin, I don't think. This is in a chest, right? This is in a chest, no surprise. So you got like a blue and purple-ish effect. That's pretty cool, I like that. I like the autos. I like how they regenerate with pixel, that's pretty neat. Uh, what do you wanna go here? So, what did that bring my power level to? Hell of a lot under 9,000, my friend. Like, going sprint is, like, good, but it's also bad versus Bakasura. Maybe I'll go sprint. I don't know. I think Shell would be better overall. I don't know. I can't really decide here. Because, like, think about it. If I go sprint, odds are he's going to get enough mobility to the, to the point where sprint isn't really going to be all that useful. Like, because he's going to be able to keep up with me regardless. So... I don't, I don't know. I feel like, uh, like overall, shells maybe more worth. I like the, the sounds. Oh, pixel. Oh my god, I thought I heard him on the roof. Like, what? Get away from there. So I got the mini so we couldn't get his passive off of that. I thought that it really mattered. Wait, so what was that effect that was around them there? I'm not sure what he's doing there. Jump, dog, jump. Is Call of Duty a percentage of my own damage? Wait, I didn't know Caller was that much faster than me. He's 110% of my own movement speed? Really? I don't know anything. <laughs> There's so many gods, like, I don't know so much about. <laughs> My lord. <laughs> like, holy crap. I know, I get people. This was supposed to be... Rainy and you little shit. <laughs> Shh. I tried to record a Scotty game previous to this, and I got kid up against Rainy, and I was like, ah. That didn't go too well. Did not feel like playing that through. Scotty versus Zemir is not very fun. Most characters versus Zemir is just not fun. I mainly versus Radiant. Oh. Oof. So, what did that bring my power level to? There's just a very specific way you have to play against Zemir. And it's like a very boring thing to do. Because like you gotta play super passively and then try to get objectives and hardly ever fight him because Ymir almost always has the advantage in engagements. Um, at least, like, in the early... Well, like, mainly on gods like, per se, Scotty. Um, you know, like, you can get caught in a position, you don't have, um, you don't have a jump or anything, things like that, just screw you over royally. Like, literally, all it is about Ymir is playing, um, based on positioning. So, what did that bring my power level to? Literally, that god is positioning. Like, it's insane. And, like, the more experience you have with the positioning and just the knowledge of matchups, like, oh my god. And like, there's, it does not surprise me how Rainian is, oh my god. That is, like, that's, that explains Rainian. <laughs> fucking dog! What the fuck? You bitch. Okay. So we just timed it for the shell war out there. Fuck off, minions! God, you almost killed me. Wait. Wait. 
No, minion! Damn it. We'll beat him. Eventually. Mm. I don't understand how Rain plays a god so much though, man. Oh my god, blows me away. It is wild. He has so much time on that god. Like, holy crap. People say, like, I don't know how you could main, like, Oler or, like, Susano or Thanatos that much. Like, I could never play a one god that much. But I'm just, like, look at. What the fuck is he doing? Like, look at Rainian, man. Like, the amount he's played. He's gonna try and eat that minion. What? Okay. Oh, that blows me away. Like, holy crap, how could you play a character that much? Like, and some, like, a character as simple as Ymir. Oh my god. I go insane. <laughs> please don't have sex, please don't have sex, please. Please don't. I'm tired of doing those recordings. No, it's not a good boy. He fucking got stuck on the wall. 2k gold up on this bitch. Wow, this is mighty fine. What is that referencing? This is mighty fine. Your middle tower is under attack. Drink a Tim Hortons copy. As they say in K Oh my god, that 360. Wait. There we go. My 360s are a little off lately. Because I don't do them as much. Because I know it's practical. I did them for one reason. Um, the reason I did 360s, like, consistently is because it used to help me get a feel for where I'd have to aim if I was to, like, say... Say there's, like, the back sewer was, like... Okay, Jesus! I'm doing a thing here! Like, let's say he's, like, right behind me, right? Okay, I'm not gonna hit those minions, though. Can you... Like, let's say, like, like the minions there are, like, someone that's chasing me or something. Like, I, like, I can hold the auto attack without losing momentum and, like... For example, in that new WoW game, right? Like, Erlong Shen was chasing me, and, my, and I have my route, right? I could turn really fast, um, and then instantly be walking in the direction. Because if you're walking backwards, see, you're not going to be going as fast, obviously. But, right? So if I was to auto-attack, and then keep myself in that direction, that's why I do that. Because it's tech- although it's not much, it's still technically faster. Um, it's little things like that that keep up momentum. It's like- uh, if you put on auto run, that's why I always jump when I leave the base, is because I'm not touching the keyboard right now. Because I'm, I'm keeping this. But you can also do things, like, cons cause so you don't lose momentum. Because if I'm to just walk and then press G, like you see I stop. So I don't lose momentum if I press G, right? But there's also things, um, whereas if you jump, you don't lose momentum in the direction that you're jumping, right? So if I let go right now, you see I still move, let go. So I could do this, right? I could, like, what I like to do is, is turn behind me as I'm doing it, because it doesn't, I don't lose momentum of the direction that I'm going. Right? I don't know. Just little things like that. It's useful for, for things like conquest and stuff. But yeah, knowing your moment- okay. Knowing your momentum and stuff like that is also kind of useful. It's like little things, I don't know. It's not like the most practical thing in the world, but it's still something, right? When you play a game long enough, you, you start to pick up the little things. And there's obviously a bunch of habits that I don't even know- I don't even do. That are obviously a lot more effective. <coughs> I'll say I do like this skin. Um, it is very similar to other pixel skins, though, I find, which isn't a bad thing per se, but there's just a lot of pixel skins. There's only so many concepts you can go through, right? That's why I wish they'd listen to the community more, you know? The community comes up with the coolest freaking skin comps, concepts, man. I should be spawning any moment. I think. Or he just got it, one of the two. He most likely just got it. Okay, fuck off. That voice line sucked. It's the best you could come up with. Like, I bet I could come up with something better than that this game. 
be like reference like Mega Man or something or anything. I don't know. Like something to do with like a power upgrade. Like, Ooh, a mint fancy schmancy upgrade. Yo, who the fuck wrote that? Your, your fucking grandkids? You look ridiculous. Yeah, you do. You are dick. Dog. <laughs> dick, dick. Hey, what the fuck? I called him back. It's not fair. Can you just die or something? Or go back to base one of the two? Come, my minions. My monkey minions. You gonna, you gonna defend that tower? No? Your team has destroyed a I need to change the announcer back as well. No, I still have that. Back. I change everything. I hate this back animation. Do -do -do -do. That is Halloween shit already. It's not even Halloween. Wow, you look ridiculous. <laughs> it's not funny. Why is he not building defense? Here's a question I don't think we're gonna get answered. So why is like it a consistent color around here? Is wait, I wanna see the front. Okay, I wish your pants were the same color as this top part. Like the okay, you see how this has got this like pink? I wish it was consistent. For some reason her ass cheeks are just move level thing. Are just like blue right right here. Eh. No, let me see the front. You tease. <laughs> okay. Come on. No, let me see it. <laughs> I WANT TO SEE THE SKIN! I'm assuming it's from the front as well though. Like this area, I guess it has like the blue here, but I don't like it. I wish it would've, they would've... I don't know. Um, I think it would've looked a little better if they had the... Hey, stop shaking the booty. Okay, or just keep going, you know, one of the two. Okay, but... I don't like the blue here. I wish they would've went with like, maybe like... A color that matched the, um... The purple there? I don't know, because it seems like it's supposed to be purple all around. You, what the fuck? How did you miss that auto? You suck! Are you serious? You only fucking got that because you suck! He missed the auto on the fuck- Are you- He missed the auto on the freaking bull demon. Are you fucking kidding? Where are you going? Apparently, like, somewhere a lot faster than me. Root him. Root him. I said root him! What the fuck? Root him! Oh my god, you dumb, dirty dog. Fucking stupid little... Wow. Yes, you jump around. You let the dogs out, motherfucker. You know a bunch of weird songs? Like, okay, so fun fact. There is a There are a bunch of songs that, like, had, like, d double meaning have like um uh, what, are, what is it called like double meanings or whatnot okay what do i want here Let's see. can you get off motherfucker like okay for example um who let the dogs out is a bunch is about yeah okay bye um who let the dogs out is a bun is about letting like about like ugly people or fat ladies in like the club or something i think <laughs> which is like <laughs> like what? And YMCA is about blowing guys, like being like a gay dude. I think. Like if you actually like, go ahead and listen to the lyrics, and you'll be like, oh my god. Like I never really realized it, but like I remember I watched a video and they're they're like, yeah, a bunch of songs like this. I like that. And I'm like, really? Yeah, apparently it's a thing. Okay, listen. Oh my god. He listened. <laughs> you know what's really weird to think about? It's like... Other than, you know, like the, the blowing gay dudes in the YMCA song, well... It's weird to think that I would much rather be fighting Bakasura and stuff like that, than... Like, the newer gods in the game. Like, like, uh, Pele or Baron, just because of how annoying they are. Like, isn't that weird? Because, like, in the past metas... Oh my god, no! Really? In the past metas, it's it's felt like throughout all of it, it there would always be, you know, 
the top dogs like AFC Buck, Kali. Um, I wouldn't say Oler because Oler recently got like higher up in the meta since his buff. Um, I would have considered him still strong, but everyone else sucked back then. I didn't know how he worked. Now he's easy. Um, and like there was all the, all these top tier gods that like you know like you would be fucking horrifying to play against them, and you'd always want to ban them like Debo and stuff like that. Nowadays. I would much rather fight a Bakasura or a Kali than fucking Pele. Like, that's ridiculous to think. Like, what? Like, like, normally with God releases, like, think of Achilles and stuff like that. Like, although they used to be really strong, like, in Duel. They kind of, like, you know, they got nerfed, they got changed a little bit. You know, to the point where it's just like, you know, you don't worry about them that much, but... Freaking Pele and Baron men. They're just not fun characters to play against. It's not like they're hard to play. And it's not like they're, you know, like, fun to play against either. I don't know. Like, I, I find them just, like, when a character's so broken, I don't know. Pele interested me because her kit seemed cool. I liked that she could reset off of the three, which was obviously a little broken, but I think they could have found, like, a countermeasure. Or at least added some auto-progression to the fucking character, right? But no, they're not going to do that. They decided not to do that, and they made her so fucking boring, and all she is is she has an instant Thanatos, Thana, Thanatos 2, an AoE, like an ult, that's ridiculous. She has a 1 that can be proc twice, and a knock-up with her 2, and that insane fucking passive, like, that does, what about that character screams, you know, oh my god, I'm dead. What the fuck was that jump?! What was that jump?! What the fuck was that jump? I went to juke back because I thought he was going to jump on me. The motherfucker jumped. Jump, 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 jump towards. Jump. He jumped towards his phoenix. Why would he do that? That was the most, that was the stupidest fucking thing I've ever seen. And it just worked. By God, he's a genius. <laughs> oh, and he had hastened there. It threw me off. If my, okay, I think I should have been able to win that engagement. If I would have just used my one, I think he would have died. I like a frostbound. You can't get that, my friend. Now you lose your own phoenix for that, so... Also, I could have backdoored you if I felt like it. But I didn't feel like it. So not a dink. So he's not going any defense, which is absolutely ridiculous. And I have thorns and he doesn't, so he just dies the next engagement. Okay, well this is not back door. This is front door. He was in found. What the fuck? Why would you just shell? What are you doing? You just look at me. He just fucking he just noped out of there. He thought I could just walk out. <laughs> Man, thought he just shelled nothing. Okay, if you enjoyed watching, please be sure to leave this video a like. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing for more awesome content like this. Anyways, I will see you in the next video, guys. Hope you have a fantastic Wednesday evening or night. Bye-bye.